Carl Einolf, Professor of Finance and Economics and Dean of the Bolt School of Business. In this two-minute lecture, we're going to examine the future value of a dollar that you have today. So imagine you go to Starbucks and you spend $4 on a cup of coffee. What could you have done with that $4? Well, you could have saved it, invested it, put it into a retirement account, and had the money later on in retirement. And so I want to calculate the future value of the $4 that we just spent on the cup of coffee. So as any student of finance knows, the future value is the present value multiplied by one plus the rate of interest to the nth power. So n is the number of years until retirement. So let's, let's say we're going to retire in 30 years. We also need to decide what rate of interest we're going to use. So an annualized average rate of return that we might expect on an investment is 5%. And we're using 5% as an inflation-adjusted real rate of return. So let's do the calculation. The $4 will grow to, so the, the future value will be $4 times 1.05 to the 30th power, or $17.29. So that $4 cup of coffee is actually costing us $17.29 in lost retirement income. So a cup of coffee is a lot more expensive than you thought it was. The other way to think about it is that the $4, you spend the $4 today, you buy yourself a cup of coffee. Instead, you could save that $4, and in your retirement, you'll have $17.29, enough to buy yourself a cup of coffee, each of three of your friends a cup of coffee, and even have a little left over to tip the barista.